Today we are going to talk about the major differences between Marchensia and Rhesia. Marchensia belongs to the genus Marchensiaceae. Rhesia belongs to the genus Rhesiaceae. In Marchensia, gemacops are present. Gemacops helps in asexual reproduction. In Rhesia, gemacops are absent. Marchensia is a dioecious plant, meaning male and female reproductive organs are present on separate plants. Rhesia is monoecious, meaning male and female reproductive organs are present on the same plant. The thallus of Marchensia is not rosette-like. The thallus of Rhesia is rosette-like. The thallus of Marchensia is heterothallic, meaning male and female reproductive organs are present on different thallus and on different plants, so they are also called dioecious. The thallus of Rhesia is homothallic, meaning Male and female reproductive organs are present on same thallus and on same plants, so it is a monoecious plant. In Marchensia, barrel shaped pores are present on the upper surface of the leaves. In Rhesia, barrel shaped pores are absent. Antheridia are male reproductive parts. Antheridia develops in groups in Marchensia. In Rhesia, Antheridia develops individually. Archegonia are female reproductive parts. Archegonia develops inside the thallus in Marchensia. Archegonia develops on the upper surface of the thallus in Rhesia. In Marchensia, the embryo is 8-celled. In Rhesia, the embryo is 4-celled. In Marchensia, sporogonium is differentiated into feet and capsules. In Rhesia, sporogonium is differentiated into feet, seti and capsules.